Hey guys, what I want to do is to show you how to connect this soundbar, Samsung C430 to your TV. You can connect this soundbar to your TV using optical cable or via Bluetooth. Optical cable is not included in the packaging. So to connect this, you need to first of all unplug the soundbar and also unplug your TV. Now go at the back of the soundbar where it's written digital audio optical. So take the cable, push it inside and it's in, then take the other end of the cable, go to back of your TV where it's written optical digital audio out, push the cable inside and it's in. So the next thing you need to do is you need to plug the sandbar to the power. You need to plug the subwoofer to the power, then plug the TV to the power. Then switch the soundbar on. And it will show you hello. Then you, you make sure, use the input, make sure it's D.in. Then switch the TV on. Now the next thing you need to do, you need to go to your TV settings. So use the gear button to go to TV settings. Scroll down to the sound. And the sound is showing us TV speaker. So you need to select on it, sound out is showing us TV speaker. Then scroll to the side to optical. Optical out device, select on it. Now this soundbar is connected. And this is the uh, audio. The corridor to the left, which I couldn't see when we first walked in. A good uh... We're open to feedback. So this samba is connected. The information we have available. Our aim is to be um, open and transparent. Now I want us to go to YouTube. This is the sound. Hey guys. What's good? How you doing? I hope you are doing well. Welcome to this channel. If you are new to this channel and, and if you are, please consider to subscribe and help the channel. Thank you very much indeed for stopping by. This is Saram. I want to show you what we got here. We got this sandbar. This is Hisense HS 2100 sandbar. This is 2.1 channel sandbar. It's called the Beast. 240 watts audio power, Dolby Audio, DTS, TV mode. What we want to do is unbox this stuff, check it out, see what is inside. This soundbar got three speakers and six equalizer settings. So let's check this stuff out and see what is inside. It will help to unleash your TV sound. So this is, this is surround. This is game. DT S Visual S Standard. This soundbar can hook it up to your TV via Bluetooth, optical cable, and HDMI. Standard. Surround. This soundbar is with wireless subwoofer. So, guys, this is how to connect this. And when it's in optical, you can only control the volume using the soundbar remote control when it's in optical. And this is the mute button. So when it's in optical, you can only control the volume with soundbar remote control. So this is how to connect this up to your TV via optical cable. What I want to do is to show you how to connect this gear to your TV via Bluetooth. You can connect this soundbar to TV using optical cable or with Bluetooth. Optical cable is not included in the packaging. So what I'm going to do is to disconnect the optical cable, then connect this to TV using Bluetooth. You know whether that was true. This or is the audio using optical cable. Case, no. Now, so we're going to switch the TV off and also switch the soundbar off. Unplug the soundbar and remove the optical cable from the soundbar. Also unplug it from the back of the TV.
so this is the optical cable now plug the sandbar to the power and also plug the tv to the power and also plug the subwoofer to the power now to connect this switch the sandbar on it will show you hello then you need to select use the input to select bt or you select bt pairing the sandbar is now in bt pairing it will show you bt pairing then the next thing you need to do is you need to switch the tv on and the tv is on so you need to go to your tv settings so use the gear button to select the tv settings then scroll down to the sound and you see the sound is showing us optical out device so you need to select the sound out select the sound out go to bluetooth and devices scroll down to device list select enter and it's now searching for available bluetooth device here we go samsung sandbar c4 series select on it this is connected samsung sandbar c4 series is connected and when it's in bluetooth you can control the volume using the sandbar remote as well as using the tv remote control so this is connected and this is the audio taken to prosecution that involves the horizon system now want to go to home now go to youtube this is the this is the audio what's good how you doing i hope you are doing well welcome to the channel i want to show you this gadget here this is lg sandbar then select Q this is surround this is 2.1 channel immersive sandbar on a budget good for money this sandbar is 300 watts audio power output sandbar itself is 100 watts the subwoofer is 200 watts hey guys what's good how you doing i hope you are doing well welcome to the channel i want to show you this gadget here this is lg sandbar s QC2 sandbar. So this is surround. One channel immersive sandbar on a budget. Game. Good for money. This sandbar is 300 watts. DTS Visual X. Sandbar itself is 100 watts. Standard. Subwoofer is 200 watts. This sandbar, you can hook it up to your TV. Via surround. Bluetooth, optical cable and USB. What we want to do is unbox this stuff. Check it out. See what is inside. I hope this will help you. To make a fun choice, this is 2.1 channel. And when the sandbar is in Bluetooth, you can control the volume using the sandbar remote, likewise using the TV remote control. Thank you very much. This is how to hook this up to your TV via Bluetooth. Thank you.